People, my people, looking right at the camera now, it's that time of the week when we um, go and visit our dear Uncle Odin, and I believe he's just received the very first um, product sample from Bancroft Bay Distillery. Uh, Bancroft Bay were kind enough to send Uncle Odin a um, sample pack for him to review, and it's as easy as reaching out in Instagram or email and saying, I've got a gin for you to look at, and, I'll, and Uncle Odin will send you his address. So without any further ado, let's go and have a chat to the old man, shall we? Who's that? People, my people, how are you? You've dropped in on your dear Uncle Odin. And have I got a treat for you? I got something in the mail today. Yep, I know. Someone sent me something. You should be jealous. I got sent a gift from Bancroft Bay Distillery. Your dear Uncle Craig contacted me and said to me, Odin, I want you to try our gins. Because, well, let me just adjust for you a little bit. Put you on the straight and narrow, as we do. Ah, oh, that's moving much better. Uncle Craig said, Odin, I want you to try this beautiful new gin I'm making and it's out in the little town of Metung. So Craig sent me three. He sent me a sample pack. And I'm sitting here and I've been wondering who would I like to share this wonderful gin with? And people, my people, you've knocked on my door. So let's hear the sound of happiness. Very gentle sound of happiness. Do you want a bit? Oh, I think I think you'll try it. Let's. People, my people, you have exquisite taste in gin. I know this because you're watching. Anyway, let's just a little bit. Just have a sip. Now I went past a protest today, and I was the protest I went past was of the League of Bad Spellers, and I looked at them. And I saw them, they were chanting, you know, they were waving placards. And on the placard they had bad spellers untie. So, let's try this wonderful. This is the shaving cream, shaving point gin. And it's a beautiful, beautiful 42%. It just, I like it already. It's as simple as that. People, my people. Sound of unhappiness. Cork going back in. Every bit as quiet as the cork coming out. So, let's try this. And I'm not going to get a look at the tasty notes that Uncle Craig so kindly sent for me. Because, well, I'm Uncle Owen and I can be difficult. And that's are you finding it's got a very clear nose on it? Hmm. Oh. Well, there's plenty of juniper in there. For me, this is a very, very subtle and subtle gin. It's really not a lot happening. I tell you what, I'm going to go and look at those tasting notes. Letting Uncle Craig's kindness go to the bad. It, he says it's a dry gin, and yes, I would definitely agree with him. It's a dry gin. Um, and he's used lemon myrtle and pepperberry. And for those of you who are watching this overseas, the Australian natives, you can't get them overseas. We are not allowing what happened with the lemon myrtle and mountain pepper. Um, what happened to the macadamia? Um, citrus on the nose and a smooth, warm finish from the pepperberries. Yep, I can definitely smell the citrus, which means Auntie Selena's going to be hijacking this one. Yes. I'm in love, Craig. This is a gin close to my heart because 
I just thought I'd try it. And the pepper berries mean that as I drink this in winter, I can drink it neat and it just warms my heart. It's just giving me that nice warm feeling and almost as much as reading about one of my favourite Australian generals. In fact, he's my favourite Australian general, John Monash. I went to the university and entered after him, would you believe it? They wouldn't allow him in the Melbourne club after the war because he was Jewish. So I've gone and visited his grave and said, John, and it's in Brighton Cemetery, by the way. I said, John, they did you a disservice. I think you were brilliant. Because after all, I spent, went to your university. That's how brilliant you are. I went to your university. Yes, this is a very simple dry gin. And Uncle Craig has just been so kind to me. Because he reached out to me and said, Odin, I want to be kind to you. And if you want to be kind to me, and you want me to review your gins as a priority, then follow Uncle Craig's example. Contact me and send me a sample pack of 200 ml bottles like this one, and I too will put you at the top of my drinking list. So people, my people, thank you for coming by. I hope you've been paying attention to these numbers that have been appearing on the screen, because there's some merchandise to be won. Not from Uncle Craig, but certainly from Brogan's Way, because Bancroft Bay Distillery out in East Gippsland in Metung, or Met, Metung, Metung, or Metung, haven't drunk enough yet. Um, there's some quite new merchandise yet, so you'll, you'll get them well. Decipher the code and win the merchandise. And I look forward to seeing you with the um, other two gins over the coming weeks. Thank you for visiting. Um, tell Marty Selena that the um, drink is about ready. I'll catch you. Bye.